I'm an anarchist, I'm a troublemaker. I think with everything I do there's a sense of mischief and fun and playfulness. People think anarchy is about smashing things up. Anarchy is not. Anarchy is about organising without organisations. It's about doing it for yourself. I'm the founder of Revolutionary Arts and we set up lots of projects like the Empty Shops Network, We Will Gather and we started Riot Cleanup as well. Riot Cleanup was an incredible day. It was started overnight with one tweet and we mobilised, I wanted 50 people, we mobilised about 12,000 across a day. The problem I'm trying to fix is that people don't feel they're part of society and I want to give them control and power again. In Britain we've given away our power and our authority to local councils. We've said it's their problem, it's up to them to fix it. We didn't do that historically. Even go back 30, 40 years, if we wanted to start a community centre, we got the people together, we raised the funds, we found the building, we did it ourselves. I don't think we've even started to unlock the potential of crowdfunding at the moment. Crowdfunding is being used for lots of very similar projects by people who are very creative. And I think the, the potential comes when a mass market, a, a mass audience take it up and start using it every day as a, a normal tool to do things. Crowdfunding could absolutely change the world, from our towns, from the streets, up to a national level. It could be a real big game changer. I've moved recently to Margate and, and my next plan is I found a, an abandoned mini golf course and I'm going um, to take that back over for the community, clean it up and get people playing, playing mini golf up on the seafront. I'm Dan Thompson, founder of Revolutionary Arts and I'm inspiring community change.